do you have a lot of GoPro footage? Let's see how you can process it with the Unit Converter. Hey everyone, I'm Dom from Wondershare Unit Converter and thanks for tuning in. GoPro cameras have endless possibilities when it comes to creating with them. That is a common thing they have with the Unit Converter, by the way. Let's see how you can help expressing yourself with GoPros and how to process the stunning footage you make with the Unit Converter. The very core purpose of a GoPro is of course to record activities that other cameras couldn't. Take it to the mountains, underwater or on your bicycle, it will record every moment of your adrenaline filled time. Timelapse videos have the power to compress hours into seconds, showing the dynamic beauty of events that unfold over time. Timelapses capture the rhythm of life in a unique way, reminding us of the beauty in the ordinary. With a little bit of creativity, your GoPro footage can become the foundation for mesmerizing visual art. Consider using freeze frames from your videos, for example, to create a collage that encapsulates the essence of your adventure. Recording amazing GoPro footage is not enough, however, you need a tool to edit the GoPro videos together. The Uniconverter 15 will help you do that with its various intuitive and powerful features. Let's see how! We're gonna work with the tool to show you some GoPro editing tips, so if you don't have it yet, make sure that you download it using the links in the description. So first and foremost, when you record with GoPro cameras, you'll have a large amount of files in the format that your camera was set to record in. If it's not MP4, it's worth converting it so you can work with it easier. To do that, open the Uniconverter and the Converter tool, import your GoPro footage, select the output format to be MP4, choose an output folder and then click on start all. Once the process is done, you can continue working on your videos. As you can see, these clips are from various sport activities. Let's see a quick GoPro video editing, so this could be shared on social media. So let's take our converted files back to the editor, where we're going to trim the video. Simply click on the scissors icon and then choose the best parts of the clip. Leave the Merge All Segments box unchecked if you want to have the video segments as separate clips. Do this with all your clips. Then, you can change the order of the videos here according to your liking. On the main converter interface, however, make sure that the Merge All Segments box is checked to have your video clips imported as one individual video. Then, choose an output format and folder and then click on Start All. If you want to add music to make your GoPro video more cinematic, import the exported video back once again. And here, under the audio tracks, import a new one with your music and then export the video again. So GoPros are able to record time lapses if you set them to do so, but if you don't, you need to speed up the video to create the time lapse effect. With the Uniconverter, it's really easy. There is a trick to it though, but it's not complicated. So, again, open the video editor and choose the change speed feature and import your video. The maximum speed you can choose at a time is 3 times. So, to have a video of under 30 seconds out of this 25 minute long video, we will have to change the speed 4 times. Let's click on start all and when it's done, repeat the process 3 more times. And after the fourth round, you'll have a nice time-lapse video of these moving clouds. Look at the original one and the sped up one side by side. Wonderful! You can share this now on social media. Now, if you want to create an artwork or put moments of your adventure into picture frames alongside your sport footage, you can use the player tool to take still images out of your clips. To do so, open the player tool in the Unit Converter and import your video clips. On the right side here you can see your playlist. Look for the moments you want to take snapshots of and then click on this button here. Then you can print these still images and use them as decorations in your home. So these are just a few neat ways to edit GoPro videos on Mac as well as on Windows since the Unit Converter is available for both operating systems. If you found these GoPro video editing tutorials useful, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching, I'll see you in the next video.